Hello, everybody, and welcome again to Music is Medicine Monday. My name is Amy Thiessen of In Resonance Coaching, and I am here every week on Mondays at 7 p.m. to share some music and maybe a little bit of inspiration and intention for the week. And now, on Wednesdays at 1 p.m., to dive a little deeper into the weekly theme and have an interactive Facebook experience where you can ask your questions or kind of your inquiries, your thoughts in a real-time way, yeah? So that's Wednesdays at 1 p.m. This week, I want to um, kind of stay with the overarching theme of coming back together in relationship and look at how do we honor the space that we need in relationships? How do we honor the space in knowing and being able to acknowledge how do we acknowledge when we need space? And then how do we ask for that in a really clear way? Um, I know with clients and just you know my own history that when we don't get the space that we need, we don't take time to connect back, when space does happen, it tends to happen really explosive, right? It tends to be really intense. But what I found is that when we can communicate our needs for space, or like going for a walk or whatever it is that we need in an effective way and in a kind way, it actually allows us to kind of mediate that intensity and to meet each other with greater capacity. For a long time, I used to really get anxious about relationships. I would really spin out, I'd really think about how do I fix that, how do I make that better? If someone was upset with me, how do I make them like me? All of that kind of stuff. What could I do, what should I do? And again and again, I realize and I've learned that it's about coming back often and seeing the forest through the trees. Relationships are complex and they're layered. And so to kind of meet that and inspire today, I've chose two songs that I think so eloquently depict this kind of dichotomy in relationship between the love and the pain, the desire, the separation, the kind of layers of it. And I chose these songs also because they're my favorite, but because I think that these are songs that might allow you to sense something in you. That's not about thinking. It might be a memory or an emotion or an impulse. And my invitation is to just let that happen. To let ourselves be moved by music and touched in that tender space, both within our own hearts and maybe within each other's. The first song is Time After Time. you I'll be waiting 
time after time If you fall I will catch you I will be waiting Time after time Time after The second song I'd like to share with you is Hallelujah by Leonard Cohen. Hallelujah, 
I think the other reason I love music is because it brings space. Space to our hearts and space to our understanding. I hope to see you all here again on Wednesday where I'm going to come online at 1 p.m. on my business page. And that's my Amy Thiessen page. This is not my personal one. To talk about how do we recognize some of the kind of, you know, flags 
How do we recognize when maybe we need space? And then how do we communicate that in a clear way? So I'm just going to offer a bunch of phrases and examples and words that you can look at and go, oh, okay, yeah, that might be a way that I could use that here. Yeah. If you have any questions, comments, anything, please comment below. Even just a heart to say hello or a smiley face. Your comments mean so much and your engagement also helps me to share this with more people. So I really appreciate it. Of course, if you have any other questions or are curious about doing a free consult, please follow the link below. Otherwise, I have hope you have the most beautiful week, and then I will see you on Wednesday at 1 p.m. for the Rise Together, where we talk about the blog. And if not, I will see you here again next Monday for Music is Medicine. Thank you so much. <laughs>